about so that intro sequence will make sense. So number one, I re-dyed my hair. We used Kool-Aid. My mom helped me. She has more experience with this. Uh, since it's Kool-Aid, it's more temporary, but any stains that were made were easier to get out, and I really like how it looks. On this camera, it looks like it's green, but it's more of a turquoise, because blue plus yellow equals green. Number two, I had a little accident on my bike yesterday, that's why I tossed it dramatically to the side of the road. I landed on my chin, and my arm, and this side of my body, and my leg, and I'm getting rid of the bike because it's caused me nothing but grief for the most part. So, yeah, that's not what I want to talk about in this video, because I keep forgetting to do this, but a few days ago, my past self was really worrying about the future, and he asked me if I was better prepared for the future, and the simple answer for that is no. You're never really prepared for the future, it just kind of happens to you, like that. That was the future. I wasn't ready, it just happened. But for the most part, I don't worry too much about the future anymore, because I know one way or another it's going to happen, and it may not go how I want it to go, and maybe it will, but either way, it'll be an experience. I forgot that a year ago already I was thinking about going to school in Canada. I thought that was just a new idea this year from the trip. But I guess looking back it makes sense now that I do want to go to Canada. And the trip just cemented that idea. Because I already have the roots in the back of my mind. I'm still not entirely sure, past me, what I'm gonna do. I do know this, me and Tristan are still planning a cross-country road trip the year after uh, I graduate from high school, the summer after, but now we've enlarged the scale. We're gonna do America, Canada, and Mexico, like the whole continent. And we're gonna use July, which is the least interrupted month of the summer for Canada, because that is our favorite. And then after that, who knows? You just gotta let it happen, man. It feels really... You have no idea how weird it feels saying, like, man to yourself from a year ago. Like, just being super casual with somebody who doesn't even know what you're saying.